Hi guys, good morning. Ooh, look at that morning sunshine. Mm. But anyway, I just want to give a quick morning message, guys. Have my little morning walk. Look at here. Boo! Somebody need to take a leap, or maybe they thinking about taking a leap. They, they, I mean, dang. <laughs> Ooh, judgment. Now, judgment, let's see. Is this spiritual judgment or judgment could mean a just a judgment that they are deciding to just go for it, right? So, let's clarify, Holy Spirit, what's judgment? Make sure y'all like and subscribe to my channel. Yeah, moving forward. Okay. So, yeah, somebody about to take a leap. They about to say, ooh, this sun. I'm sorry, guys. I'm just, I love myself. So, it's just like... Not in a casita way, I'm just saying. Um, yeah, somebody about to take a leap, man. They can't take it no more. They see you on your chariot. They may hop in a car and come fast. Yeah, they want to communicate, uh, Holy Spirit. Maybe the Holy Spirit trying to communicate for pentacles. I feel like the Holy Spirit trying to communicate to tell this person to go ahead and move forward. They could be still holding back with the Four of Pentacles, or maybe they holding back communicating. Why they holding back, Spirit? Why they holding back? Low vibrationals, you guys are a bunch of fools for coming for an uh, Empress here. Mm -hmm. Ooh, wait a minute. You see how that fell? Look at here. Emperor, they being stubborn. The Emperor being stubborn. You may have some options. Maybe both of y'all are being stubborn. King and Queen of Swords here. So both of y'all could not be talking to each other. Like, y'all may be being stubborn. Okay? Seven of Cups. What's the Seven of Cups? Is both of y'all confused? Some, it's like both of y'all ain't a King and Queen of Swords. It's like, if you better come with the truth, I'm going to cut you. So both of y'all are two, two, two on the clock. Both of y'all are in that, um, you know, that energy of like, I ain't playing with nobody. Yeah, man, I can't make it up. Both of y'all are in this energy of healing. Y'all both probably watching each other, but y'all ain't saying nothing. And Spirit is saying, communicate, move forward. If y'all long distance, Spirit could be trying to get y'all to... Go towards the one you love, right? Follow your intuition on this. I feel like both of y'all are healed. Both of y'all are mirroring each other. And you guys just not saying nothing. Yeah. Yes. God said. <laughs> your hair fine. Your person looking here. He want, he want to be loyal to you. Now, is he married though, spirit? Or what's the hair fine? Because it could mean that they married. Oh, dang. It could mean, I'm sorry, guys. It could mean that they marry or um, Eight of Pentacles. Yeah, they want to work on things collective. They want to marry you. You might be mad right now. <laughs> High Priestess. Mm -hmm. They know you mad. So both of y'all might have gotten into a big argument or fight. So both of y'all are in y'all Queen of Swords energy. Because if you look at that, the King and Queen of Swords right here, it's like both of y'all being stubborn or maybe your man being stubborn. But look, both of y'all, I don't know. Like, yeah, both of y'all still facing the same way. That's what I'm saying. It's like y'all both mirroring each other. Y'all both speaking y'all truth. It's like, come with the truth or I'm going to cut you. Y'all could be speaking y'all truth and cutting bitches out that don't serve you. Yeah, cutting out all these options and lovers and everything. Because y'all know y'all want to heal it. But y'all may not be saying nothing. Y'all just looking at social media. Okay? Now, what I would, when I am picking up, your emperor might be still married. And he could be just watching you. You could be long distance. Um, He could be wanting to come towards you. But he could be in a marriage or wanting to work on things with you maybe this is a husband and then um because we got the five of wands maybe you feel like it's some competition now what's the five of wands <clears throat> but 
vibe as I looked up. 5.05 on the clock. Some changes. Something changed. What's the 5 of mine saying? Mm. Eight of Swords. Hangman. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I feel like he feels stuck or trapped in this marriage. Okay, so for some of y'all, this is an emperor who's married. Um, this person feels stuck and trapped in this marriage that he even got himself into. And he keep looking at you, high priestess. Yeah, he knows. He could have secrets too. Okay, for some of y'all, you are a high priestess and you know this person's secrets and this person is scared to come to you. You may be intimidating a little bit because I see her holding this crystal ball. It's like you you got a good insight. You know what this person up to. And they're kind of scared to come towards you. They do want to work on it. They do see you as a commitment. But you are high priestess. So, I mean, but what's the if, if they're your twin or soulmate, they are too. So what's the problem? <laughs> or oh, they got secrets. What's the high priestess? What secrets? They might got some secrets. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. So they lying. So what's their secret? Because that's why they ain't coming towards you. What, what What's the seven of swords? What they had in spirit? Because I know you're going to tell me. What they had. Why they don't want to come. Oh, third party. Maybe broke their heart. Stole their money. Lied to them. Or oh, they know they broke your heart. Yeah, betrayal. Ten of swords. Talk about an ending or betrayal. Could have been with a, a, a secret relationship. So, because they put you in a third party, they got put in a third party. Tower, go around, come around. So, this is what they're hiding. Maybe this is what um, they don't want to tell you. Yeah, because they're in regret. They could have left you and, and went and offered to someone else here. Maybe another guy, a girl. They could have rejected you and went to somebody else. And that person gave him money or proposed to them right away. They may have thought she had some type of money. This could have been like a threesome, maybe. The person that they were with, yeah, the commitment they were in allowed this person to go out and have kind of like threesomes or like a, it was like an open marriage here. But initially, that could have been an agreement, but... This person ended up getting hurt because the marriage they thought was so open. They didn't realize this karmic or this whoever this is over here, child. Your emperor could have been the one hoeing or his mate. The one he married to left you for. Somebody was wines equals sex. So somebody definitely was having a lot of sex. So this karmic could have been having like a lot of secret third party men that they didn't know about that was giving them money. Because she wanted some money. Yeah, Queen of Wands liked to uh, sexual, you know, sexual. She was using her sexuality to obtain house and status and money and all of that. And your person maybe didn't even know where she was getting the money from. He probably thought she had a job working and whatnot. And the whole time she was hoeing. King of Queen of Wands, maybe they both was home. I feel like they both had some lovers here. Because Ten of Pentacles talk about like longevity, commitment, finances, you know, trying to have some big heap of money. King and Queen of Wands. This could be both of y'all, because this is a twin flame reading here, because I keep getting couples, King and Queen of Wands. I'm surprised King of Queen of Swords popped out. I think, too, also, you're so beautiful, Collective. They feel like if they come back and you reject them, they may not know how to, like, deal with that. Because they already think about you a lot. Okay, but they also got secrets. The secret is they got a shocking uh, betrayal because somebody stole their money, stole their credit cards, and ran off in another relationship. Yeah, Queen of Pentacles, I told you. Knight of Pentacles slowed their money down. This Queen of Pentacles, whoever they was with, they she was all about money and finances and whatever. And she definitely did some thieving here, stole something, and went off to another relationship. He didn't see this coming with the tower. 
Yeah, world well, went around, came right back on around again. He didn't see this coming. So he tried to play you. He tried to and got played. This person was secretly married. This person, he married. She could have been married and was secretly married. That's what I'm picking up for some of y'all. Others of you, it was your person and their wife was whores. They were like sleeping around for like a status or whatever to get some. Because the Ten of Pentacles talk about like status. Like, you know, this were people, this was the secret. Like nobody didn't know this, but whoever they married, she was a whore. She used her beauty. And because King and Queen of Wands, okay, so the reason why I'm saying whore, because look, you got the Queen of Wands that talk about using your wand. Remember, wand equals sex. So, yes, Wands also talks about action and passion. 11 11 on the clock. So, this could be a twin flame. Okay, so he is burdened that you are very beautiful. Okay, all right, it makes him weak, it makes him weak and vulnerable. He do not really like that, right? And if you reject him, if when he take this action, okay, he's going to be definitely in his feelings, okay, because he kind of want to come to your house, or maybe he's going to show up at your house, I don't know, maybe he wants you to live with him, but he, he had in that he really want a commitment, that's what I'm saying, so he could be, he may try to, <clears throat> look what's at the bottom of the deck, the truth, all right. And I hear airplane, so you know when I tell the truth, that airplane come out. So listen, he do regret rejecting you. He regret all these options because at the end of the day, he betrayed his soul partnership for sex, right? For material things. And then in return, he got betrayed here with the seven of swords, ten of wands, heartbreak. So he done got his lesson. So the thing is, he want to hide this from you, collecting. <laughs> He don't want you to know all this went down, okay? He just want to come back and try to be your captain's able hope, but that ain't how it go. Eight of swords, he's stuck. He's stuck. He mad about it, though. But he's stuck, okay? So, and also I feel like he's stuck because he keeps fighting to work on himself, right? He keeps fighting he knows God is telling him you are the one and he needs to clean himself up and be loyal. So I feel like he just keep fighting that. Being stubborn. Yeah. Judgment. So now he kind of trapped and stuck under judgment. Okay. He needs to take a leap and communicate with Spirit is saying and move on. But you keep on holding back. Yeah, your emperor being stubborn here, acting like the king of swords. King of swords also talks about just a plain look, like they don't have no feelings. You know, ain't no ace of cups come out here. Ain't no ace of cups. I ain't seen no ace of cups. I seen the lovers, but I didn't see no ace of cups. So it's like this person just holding back, acting like he don't care that he got a whole lover's relationship but he fooled with a lot of queen of swords too so queen of swords women are women that's very cold they got sharp tongues they just want sex or whatever they get and they gone right that's also a queen of swords but she intelligent but she has a real sharp tongue okay so some of you guys too, you got an emperor who's still with a lot of queen of swords, women, a lot of options. And spirit is saying they need to heal these sex addictions and stuff that they got going on. They thinking very immaturely. It's like they having sex with so many women, but yet they looking at you collective and you selling away. And they stuck under judgment because they sat up here and fight the fact that they needed to work on work with God and be loyal to you yeah two of cups so now it's judgment time so what's the judgment with this whole situation here need to surrender masculine yeah take action take action 
Queen of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, you know, Page of Cups. It's 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 I feel like Spirit is saying as long as you keep going over there having sex with these women, that's not abundant. You're not gonna get anything. Queen of Wands. What's the ace of wands? Is that sex or new beginnings? Next to the queen of pentacles in reverse. Yeah, that's karma. Yeah. So as long as, like I was saying, as long as you're being in that king of wands energy and it's in reverse, being a whore, rejecting, rejecting offers, rejecting what spirit is saying, you're rejecting your happiness you're rejecting your life purpose you're blocking your intuition you're rejecting by giving these women that don't give a care about you your energy my mask man you got a witch bitch over here about to get karma because she ain't apologetic for over here messing with your money yeah she don't love you it's all about money ten of pentacles pentacles talk about pentacles money legacy yeah she just she feel like she justified for taking away your emotions and not caring about hurting people so because she feel like that spirit say karma yeah justice karma i was looking at the scale here it's like the, the karma justice gotta get balanced out here who is this queen of wands then I'm over it. <laughs> Cause this queen of wands get on my nerves. Yeah, you regretful now, aren't you? Which bitch? Cause guess what? He still love who he love. Mm hmm. He's still in love with the divine feminine. He may be just juggling, you know, trying to figure out what to do. Empress, Queen of Cups, cause you loving and caring. Right? And he know he done messed up. He feel left out. Yeah. And you may leaving him out and don't want to work with him. Yeah, because you, you winning. You on your horse. You like, I don't care. Yeah. I feel like you, he feel like you don't love them, him. And that's the truth. Because he know, because you know the truth about what this masculine was doing. What is King of Cups? Who is it? Cancer, Pisces. I see all the signs. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Um... Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. We definitely got a uh, water sign. We definitely got Libras, air signs all on the board. We definitely, definitely got a Libra, uh, Gemini, Scorpio, Aries, Pisces, Seven of Swords. Because they lying. They lying to themselves. They lying about it. Lying about doing that moon magic. This queen of wands, that's why she under karma. Yeah, ain't nothing abundant. Ain't nothing finna grow. Mm -hmm. She knew about your legacy, Divine Feminine. She did. She didn't want you to get no wishes. She, But it backfired on her. Because the universe had to balance this out, man. Because you didn't do nothing wrong. This person was very vindictive. All right, guys. So that has been your morning messages. Make sure y'all like and subscribe to my channel. And once again, let's just get some advice for you. Is this something that the collective need to be uh, pursuing? What should the collective do in these situations, guys? Because there's so much going on. Okay, up or down, spirit. Because somebody do got a king of wands in reverse. Don't even take no action, spirit, saying... This king of wands may come back. Spirits say, don't take no action with this person. They are under karma. Okay, so they may try to come back. Okay. Yeah, six of pentacles. Yes, it's your past coming back. King of swords could be a Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. And then they're going to come back in a king of swords, emperor energy, stubborn and like, Holding back, communication, not talking and whatever. Gonna ask you for some money. Mm -mm. Yeah, it ain't, it's not worth it. Being stubborn and in the king of swords energy. You need to come back to somebody in a king of cups. 
I don't see no cups. What I see is wands, swords, and money. Sex, thinking about it, and Ace of Pentacles. Ain't no Ace of Cups came out. So that let me know whoever this King of Wands gonna come. Yeah. Whoever this King of Wands is, this person, Six of Pentacles, yeah, they're unstable. They're unbalanced. Spirit saying, continue to stand up for yourself and block this person. They may not even be coming back for real because they under judgment. All in reverse. Everything in reverse. And they heartbroken. But just in case if they do decide to come back and try to win you over, Collective, they're going to try to say that they healed and they want to give you justice. That's not true. They've got legal issues. Exactly. Ten of Swords. They done betrayed somebody, possibly stabbed or murdered or something serious. It could be something serious. They ain't going to tell you. And they trying to come back here and ask for your money. Or they could be on the run with the law with the justice being here. And they may need some place to stay. So don't get yourself involved because if these people robbed and stole something and they running to you, you can go to jail. Exactly. Three of Cups in reverse. Yeah, don't celebrate with this person. Yeah, don't take no action. Page of Wands. Don't take no action, man. Do not do it. They're getting weak from the magic. Okay, this could be a fake-ass Empress Karmic or somebody coming back, too. Okay, so Spirit is saying, look, they just want your money. Don't take these people back. And if you're unsure, get book a reading with me or ask God to give you a sign, okay? Don't take these folks back. Not right now. This is not the time for no past it's people to come back trying to offer you something. Yeah, this King of Wands, he a whore. The king and queen of king of wands and the queen of cups is trying to come back, guys. They karmics, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, uh, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. These two in reverse, they are karmics, they don't have no feelings. These people are sick, they're unbalanced. Okay, they're gonna try to reach out in social media. Okay, to you, Emperor. Okay. You may go both ways, so you may have a male and female trying to reach back out to you. And Spirit is saying, cut them bitches off. Don't take these people back from your past. You will regret it. You're going to be right back. The wheel, the wheel is going to reverse right back. They the devil. You see, the devil going to be at the top of your wheel. Okay? Empress, stay strong. Okay? This magic that these people doing immaturely, they don't know what they doing. It's coming back. It's slowing down their money. Oh, no, it's coming back fast. My bad. And this could be a karmic trying to come back, too. Because we got the three of cups after that, which talks about a conjoining. But spirit is saying these people, okay, is getting karma for betraying you, from killing someone. I keep getting, like, somebody stabbed or killed somebody. It's a body in the lake. Could be a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Okay. These people do not love you, Emperor, Empress. Anybody, them karmics, y'all. Y'all know them karmics y'all been dealing with. Do not take these karmics back. And for some of y'all, it's it's your actual Emperor twin. You got to make sure this person ain't just coming back trying to play on that. Okay? Yeah, hold back from these people. They getting that spiritual ass whooping. They trying to run. Okay, Collective, you keep strong, all right? All right, deja vu, Tarot. Peace.